welcome to Party Monsters TV. My name is Party Monster Matty and welcome to the Science Show. Now, we've got a very special edition of the Science Show today. So we're gonna get you guys to have a guess at home if you think which of these items today are gonna sink and which ones are gonna float. Now, we've, we've got six items right here. We've got three on each side. So on this side, we're gonna be testing a few different things. We've got a lemon, We've also got a kiwi, and also lastly on this side we have a banana. And then on this side we've got a few things. We have got a bell pepper right here. Now you probably find these in your cooking, normally a, a spaghetti bolognese, something like that. Good old uh, bell pepper. Also got a egg as well. And lastly we have got a can of Coca-Cola. Now this one is the full fat one, not open, it's all sealed. So yeah, we're going to be testing these six items today to see if they float or if they sink. So for our first item, we have a lemon. Now, before we put this in guys, do you think it's going to float or do you think it's going to sink? I'm going to give you three seconds to guess at home. Ready? One, two, three. Time's up. Right, we're going to put it in right now. Here we go. And a lemon floats. So if you said floats, well done. Right, let's test the next item. So next up we got is a kiwi. I'm gonna put that in there. Will it sink or will it float? Three seconds, ready? One, two, three. Will it sink or will it float? Here we go. So the kiwi has actually sunk to the bottom. So if you said sunk, well done. And for the last item on this side, we have got a banana. So, will the banana sink or will it float on the top? You've got three seconds, ready? One, two, three. Right, time's up, here we go. Will it sink or will it float? Right, the banana floats, so if you said float, well done. Right, so we're gonna move on now and test these three. Now we're gonna start off with the bell pepper. Will it sink or will it float? We've got three seconds. Ready, one, two, three. Right, put it in now, will it sink or will it float? Here we go. And it floats. So if you said float, well done. Right, now, the next one we got is an egg. Now this is a raw egg, it hasn't been cooked in any way. Now, do you think an egg will float or will it sink? Ready, got three seconds, ready? One, two, three. Right, here we go. The egg is going in, will it sink or will it float? And a raw egg sinks to the bottom. So if you said sink, well done, you are correct. And last but not least, guys, we have got the full fat Coca-Cola. Now, do we think it could float or do we think it's going to sink? This one could be a hard one. So, have a little think of your three seconds. Do you think it's going to sink or do you think it's going to float? Ready? One, two, three. Right. We're going to put it in right now so everyone get ready. We're going to put it in sideways. There's no air pockets ready. Here we go. So if you said float, then that is correct. So guys, the reason that an item either sinks or it floats is because of one very simple thing, and that is called density. So what density is, is it's the amount of how compact inside of an item it is. Now, if there's lots of air inside that item, then it's gonna float. However, if there's not gonna be any air in there, then it's gonna sink to the bottom. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video today. This has been our science show where we've been testing a few items to see if it sinks or it floats. Make sure to, if you enjoyed the video today, to give us a thumbs up, and also don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Guys, I look forward to seeing you all for our next video, and I'll see you later. Bye.